Hello! Today we're going to continue to work on the IE vowel team. Remember a vowel team is two vowel letters, I and E in this case, working together to represent one sound. IE can represent two different sounds. IE can represent the long E like thief or the long I like pie. It's more common for the IE sound to represent the long E sound like thief, which is why I have it boxed in here. Let's go ahead and get warmed up by thinking about those sounds, I and E. I'll say a word, and when I say either I or E, I want you to point to which sound it is. Ready? The word is lies. I like pie. Yield. E like thief. Chief. E like thief. Brief. E like thief. Pie. I like pie. Died. I like pie. Fiend. E like thief. Yield. E like thief. Excellent. So as we're reading and you see that I E vowel team, really try it out. Think, does it possibly say E like thief? If that doesn't sound right, try I like pie. Today we're going to be reading some stories. The first thing we want to do is just get our eyes used to skimming and scanning for that IE vowel team. Take a second and point to as many of that, those IE vowel teams as you can. I'll highlight them as we do. I'm guessing you're going faster than me and that's great. Where can you see those IE vowel teams? What do you think? Did we find them all? Were there any that I missed? Hopefully not. Let's go ahead and practice reading just those highlighted words. Ready? Thieves. Thieves. Spied. Pies. Thief. Lied. Priest. Thieves. Pies. Thief. Tried. Pie, fries, priest, pie, shrieked, thief, thieves, lied, pie, thieves, tried, pie. So I'm guessing you probably already have a clue to what this story is about. Listen and follow along with me as I read it along the first time, really paying attention to those IE vowel team words. The Three Thieves Three thieves spied three pies. One thief lied to the priest. He said the thieves did not want to take the pies. One thief tried to take one pie by hiding it under a plate of fries. When the priest saw the pie was gone, he shrieked, Stop, thief! You thieves lied and took my pie. The thieves tried to run off with the pie, but were stopped by the cops. Ready? Read along with me this time. Let's begin. The Three Thieves Three thieves spied three pies. One thief lied to the priest. He said the thieves did not want to take the pies. One thief tried to take one pie by hiding it under a plate of fries. When the priest saw the pie was gone, he shrieked, Stop, thief! You thieves!
thieves lied and took my pie. The thieves tried to run off with the pie, but were stopped by the cops. Nice reading. This next time I want you to read it on your own. If you get done before I stop the timer, just go back to the beginning and try reading it again to work on your smoothness. Pay close attention to those IE words. If you can't remember what it says, try E like thief or I like pie. Ready? Begin. Nice reading. Hopefully you were able to get all of those highlighted words with the IE vowel team and you were able to read it at least once to work on that smoothness. Let's look at another story. This story is called The Chief Cried. Remember, when you come to a word, if you're not sure how to read it, you look carefully and find those patterns that are working together. The CH is working together so to say CH. The IE vowel team can either say E, CH, E, F, or I, CH, I, F. Well, CHIFE is in a word, so it must be CHIEF. Let's skim again and just find some of the words, but we don't necessarily find all of them. Help me to find them. Use your finger and point them out to me. Practice reading each of those highlighted words on your own. If you're not sure, try E like thief or I like pie. Let's read them together to double check your work. Chiefs, field, chief, shrieked, cried, cried, grief, chief, cried, cried, grieved, priest. Let's go ahead and start by reading this one together. We've already read some of the more tricky words, and then I'll have you practice it on your own. Ready? Let's begin. The chief cried. The chief's job was to mow the field. The chief's, the chief shrieked as he ran over a frog. He cried and cried from the grief. When the chief got home, he told his wife, she also cried and cried. She also grieved for the frog. They met their priest for lunch. He told them it was okay. Everyone cries. Then they ate their fries and had apple pie. The chief and his wife got two apple pies and two cherry pies to take home. When they got home, they cried more. Then they ate some apple pie 
and cherry pie and no longer cried. I guess that pie cheered him right up. Okay, I want you to go ahead and practice reading it on your own. Remember, if you get done before the time is up, just come back to the beginning and practice again, working on that smoothness and fluency. Go ahead and begin. Nice reading. There's just one last story. Now this name here, hmm, they may not be very familiar to you. We can start by thinking of it as b, er, e, b, er, i. Well, I've heard of brie as a girl's name before, and a type of cheese, I think, but not bri before. So we're going to read this girl's name as brie. Brie and Sue. Now this time, I'm not going to help you out by finding the words first and practicing those words. This time, I truly want you to try it all on your own. You can still use that strategy, though, of finding the words, practicing those words, and then reading the story. Because everyone might need a slightly different amount of time to practice and read the story, I'm going to have you pause the video while you read it to yourself. After you've read it to yourself at least once, you can do it more if you want. Then I want you to hit play, and we'll practice it together once. But please try to read it first yourself so that you can really use those decoding skills. Remember, I-E can say E like thief or I like pie. Go ahead and pause the video now so you can practice reading the story. Welcome back. How did it go? Were you able to find those I-E words and practice them with either E like thief or I like pie? Let's see how you did and read the story together. Ready? Begin. Bree and Sue. Bree wants a friend. She gave Sue a piece of dried fruit. Sue trips and the fruit flies through the air. Bree spies the rest of the bag and tries to give Sue more. She tried to shield Sue from a brief bit of being sad. Bree wants Sue to feel like blue skies are near her. Bree and Sue tied a rope between the trees in the field. They walked to the yield sign on the other side of the field. They raced from the yield sign to the rope tied between the trees. Bree and Sue then tied the rope to their wrists and then to their legs. Bree and Sue were now friends. Nice job. So today we really worked on that IE vowel team. Remember, IE says either E like thief or I like pie. If you're not sure, sure, try E like thief first and then try I like pie. Thanks so much for working with me today. I hope you have a great rest of your day.